Today we're planting our largest Habitat Hero demonstration garden to date with over 3,000 native plants. And by planting bird-friendly plants, you provide birds with food and shelter and places to breed. And that's the idea behind Habitat Hero, a core program of Audubon Rockies. Jack Solar Garden is a 1.2 megawatt solar array where we're gonna elevate the panels up, space them out so that we can actually grow crops underneath and around the solar panels. And then around the perimeter of it, Audubon Rockies has over 3,000 plants that have gone in around the perimeter of our solar array. So not only are we creating a place that's ideal habitat for birds, we're able to connect the community to nature as we offer volunteer opportunities and also the farm is open weekly for farm tours. We're also looking at being a model for other green industry leaders. As we look into the future in creating renewable energies, we want to do it in a responsible way and really looking at how we impact the land, how we impact our bird populations, and how can we do this responsibly? How can we coexist with nature and the green industry? And we're going to use science to back this up we will have bird and monitoring surveys in place. We'll work with our volunteers and local Audubon chapters to conduct these surveys, especially during the spring and fall migrations, to look at the health of our bird populations out there and hopefully note an increase in bird diversity and abundance over the years. So I'm really excited about the plant palette that we're choosing to use here at Jack Solar Garden because it includes lots of things that not only provide habitat for birds and butterflies and bees, but also provide food for people. When this project's all done, I'm really excited to see a community solar energy project of larger than a megawatt producing energy for our local community. And instead of locking that solar array in a chain link fence, we've created this living fence that goes around it that provides habitat and food. And also we want to work with school kids. We want to work with the community. We want to have educational tours where people can come out, walk on our farm, see what's growing underneath the panels so that they can understand how we can have, we can produce both solar energy and food all in the same location. We need your support and you can support this project both financially and also with your time. Throughout the growing season, every Saturday and Sunday during the morning hours, we are welcoming volunteers and then also financially as this project moves forward into the future, we need to make sure that we have enough funds to support our monitoring and bird survey projects, uh, to replace any plants that did not survive, and also for pulling together the big ribbon cutting ceremony in summer of 2021. 